good morning and welcome to vlog number three in this long exhausting and tedious series of things that we like to call vlogs um, it's the first game for Atherton Colliers in the Evo Stick League which doesn't sound like much but, but they are the nation's favourite glue brand adhesives if you need some adhesive go to Evo Stick and it's the highest we've played in 101 years so it's going to be quite good we're off to Colne who we know quite well from the North West Counties days and I'm off to get the bus to Manchester and then the train I just take a second as well to apologise if the camera does go up my nose at some stage today this phone's quite zoomed in um, I was thinking about rearranging not re erecting, resurrecting the old phone for today. But as I drink during the day, you may end up getting closer and closer to my face, but I'll try and make sure that doesn't happen. I'll I'll just do that when we're interviewing a meal later. So I have now arrived at Rose Grove, which is just outside Burnley. It was such a boring journey from Manchester up here, but I'm now just five minutes away on the train, which should be coming in on this platform soon. Um, and Rob will be on it as well. He's reserved me a seat. Uh, yeah, so that's about it. I'll see you in Colm, the hot spot of Northern England. Right, we have now arrived in beautiful Colm. Where are we going now, Rob? Um, Colm. Where are we going? In Colm. Where, where do you think we're going to go? Oh, Spoons. Nope. I don't know then. Waitrose. Waitrose. We're not. No. Colm doesn't have a Waitrose. We are going to Spoons. Right, so we're going there for a bit and then we'll be a bit spontaneous. A bit like everybody else who's found themselves in this beautiful Lancashire village this morning. So we are in the Duke of Lancaster. What do you think, Rob? From the groins, all right. Everybody loves listening to Liverpool. Considering Colm is no way to Liverpool, there's a lot of fans. Do you think any of them will be at the game? Nah, no chance. Yeah. It smells nice though. I quite like my bathroom to smell like this month. It's amazing what an air diffuser can do.
So we've um, just come across an interesting character. We were waiting to cross the road and this woman, she started washing her feet in a puddle, didn't she Rob? Yeah. Where are you going you? No. Started washing her feet in a puddle. Thought nothing of it. And she started speaking to us and thought, right, I'm in here. I mean, she was about 50, but I thought, I'm in here. And then, what did you think she was doing? Because she could have needed a bath or you don't know do you? It's like that camper van past. Um, anyway, we're stood there waiting for all the traffic to go past. I mean there's not much traffic in Colton as you know. And then she said, Oh, I've just stepped in some dog poop. And I thought, oh, great. Nice to meet you as well. Um and even our our mate here. He thought the same, and we were stood there. She just kept on hot dog poo. So I then said I prefer to walk down the motorway, just down the road, because there's no dog poo on there. And she believed me. So that's the kind of person you're dealing with when you walk into football grounds. Hello and welcome to Cole. We've managed to blag our way up a ladder, which isn't that safe, onto this piece of scaffolding, which is overlooking the pitch. So I think we'll be stood up here for a while. Um, it's about five minutes until kickoff, so we'll see what happens. Are you, are you looking forward to it? Yeah, it should be a good game. Good first test. Teams are going to know pretty well. -ish. So, a good kind of game to help us get settled, I reckon. Mm. I think we'll lose 6 0. Hey, well played for what? <laughs> Get it, Mom! Welcome. Fucking here, boys. We are here. Fucking did it. Woo! 
Game finished 2-0 to Coles. Um, we said we end the last season. We dare to dream. We dare to dream after being beyond our wildest dream for two seasons. We dare to dream. Mm. We come to Cole. Game between the last two champions of North West Counties League. Unbelievable. Unbelievable to know. Yes, so, I mean, did you ever. Obviously, you never really thought we'd ever get to the Evo oh, stick. Oh, I never to, thought to, we'd get to Sorry. win in the Evo stick. How would you feel? Well, I mean, I mean, never thought we'd get to Evo stick, but it's been the longest pre season in history. I mean, the season <laughs> finished on the 24th of April. When some of looked forward to it, it was so, so unbelievably long and then like we come here, we teamed up with Cole and it's going to be a good game now. It's unbelievable, I can't believe we've we won it in Evo Stick. Everton Core is in Evo Stick, but we've won it in Evo Stick and we deserved it today. So was it three years ago we were in Division 1? I mean we were in Division 1 for four or five seasons after going down in um, 8 or 9 and we tried our hardest, but we always we always lost out to a couple of teams who were a bit far far ahead of us. And we, but like you said, he'd get us up into um, first division or into Premier Division in twelve months. He said to Paul Gregory, he'll um, get us in Evo Stick in three years. I think he was joking, as he said he was joking. But I mean, we didn't take him on, even in that. Um, 15, 16, I mean, it, it was a bloody miracle when we had for even apply for Evo Stick. It's just crazy. I mean, and then we come here, call their favourites, and for the game, I mean, we were, I just can't. But excellent. It was super. We were our best performance of the season so far. <laughs> Definitely. Yeah, so we got Kendall on Monday, so it's a good start. Oh, Kendall. Kendall on Monday. Everton Core is hosting. Um, an Evo stick game. <laughs> uh, it just is, yep, yeah, unbelievable. I can't I keep saying unbelievable. I mean, I'm a one trick pony with it, but if anybody reads this or listens to it, just get down to Kenside Stadium on Monday. These group of majority local lads are working hard, the committee is back to 100%. Just get down, I mean, it. It's going to be an emotional occasion for me and Gibbo, I know, but just get down. We won't cry this time. We'll, we'll not cry that. <laughs> I, I had a few tears after the Abbey Air, Air game, but you know, just please get down and give the lads a chance. That's all we said. We're now yeah. back at Cheers. Colt, as you can see. It's been a good day out in Colm. If you'd have asked me this morning, I don't think we'd have won, but you can't really be that negative, can you? Um, so, our next game is here on Monday night. Our first ever home game in the Evo Stick League. And just to kind of re emphasise what people have said all the last few months, if you'd have said three years ago that Coles would be in the Evo Stick League, they'd have laughed at you. And it may seem tin pot or small, but for us to get two promotions in three years and end up in a league with the likes of Scarborough and South Shields, who got over 1,500 fans in today and things like that. It's just fantastic. So hopefully, as the sun's setting, we'll see you down here on Monday night when we host Kendall in what will be an historical game. <laughs>